The Marine Mammal Center in Morro Bay is looking to train 25 to 30 new volunteers before elephant seal pups arrive on the central coast early next year. Cameras are rolling as an injured sea otter nursed back to health is released back into the wild at Avila Beach. The otter, affectionately named Spinny, made a triumphant return to the ocean on November 10th. And our mission's really global ocean conservation, and I think that's a mission that really speaks to a lot of people. The Sausalito-based Marine Mammal Center is the largest ocean animal hospital in the world, and their Morro Bay field office plays an important role in helping injured marine life. We are kind of a triage center, so we bring them here and we give them immediate help under the guidance of the vet's staff that's up at Sausalito. The latest rescue happened Tuesday at Avila Beach. This sea lion was found with a deep gash in one of its flippers. Volunteers say it's easy to become attached to the animals they rescue. They have personalities. I remember a lot of them. I remember the first elephant seal that I restrained so that we could to feed him. Um, his name was Donkey. <laughs> <laughs> the Marine Mammal Center is looking to train dozens of new volunteers before elephant seal pupping season begins at San Simeon. They spend about four weeks with their mom and then mom leaves and they have to figure out how to be seals all by themselves. The center sees a sharp uptick in rescues from late December through February as elephant seal pups are thrown out into the real world. So some of them don't do so well and that's when we step in. The center is now looking for volunteers to fill a wide variety of roles. If part of it seems intimidating to you. There are other roles. Um, some people don't like to do rescues, although most of us love to do rescues. Um, people can just do animal care. We need transport drivers. Now the Marine Mammal Center is looking to recruit new volunteers right now and orientation day is on January 14th. Reporting in Morro Bay, Austin Herbaugh, KSBY News.